And welcome back. This is Coattail Rights Event. Having a good week. It is Friday and round two. Let's see, it is a Hagerstown Turnpike 281 on the pop. 141 for the defending CSA versus one the Union team. And they are on the new rules, so they now have a 40, same as the HRE, which is um, still start time at 40, but now it's no bayonets and no sprinting until the 30 minute mark. So. See how that uh, impacts um, so this on, on this yeah, Union yeah. team, though. We have the Fourth Georgia, the Sixth Texas, the SR joined by the AGL, or should AGL join by SR? The Third Alabama, the Sixth New York, and the LFL. And take a look at these commanders here. We've got Hookah leading the LFL, McIntyre leading the Fourth Georgia. I'm about 20 men for Truslow leading the AGL, so Williamson leading the 3rd Alabama, position. and Dar leading the 6th New York. Let's take a look at that Artie team here. So we've got Cato leading the LFL. He is joined by Jeff Davis Battery under Habib, and Saya leading the AGL. Take a look at that CSA team. I think I'll do the Artie first. So back here we have the SB under dot point. We have Dalheimer leading the VA bat. And we have 8th Florida under Perkington leading another gun. Let's see, on the infantry side we have the 56th Virginia, the 52nd New York under O'Keefe. The ANV, the 20th Georgia, the 8th Florida. The German Corps right face. Right face. Right face. Right face. and the SB. So we've got V Bar leading the 20th. Og is leading the 8th Florida. Jumbo leading the 20th Georgia. Joe leading the A and V. And Venom leading the SB. Did I miss anybody? Slaughter is leading the 56. I don't know if I mentioned him. No one mentioned O'Keefe. I think that's everybody. All right, we are off here, and the CSA is moving forward at a brisk pace here towards the hill, as is this Union team. We will see who gets there first. You can sprint to catch up, just don't sprint in general. Again, there is no sprinting right now, so... Union's going to try to get to this hill first. Wow, the CSA is not going straight in. Instead, they're going to try to envelop the hill. Killer coming up in a very valuable position on this side here. I think this may pay dividends for him. Oh, I see the man. I will send them buck. See, Texas is out lo reloading out here in the open, and that may, might make up uh, Let's see if that works for them. Let's see how LFL comes back in and tucks in. That's a little bit... Uh, more advantageous. Now we do have one element out here. I bet this is Dar. Yep. Coming out of here as a uh, bit of a skirmish element to deal with the uh, artillery. Oh. Colonel Vibar got nailed by that already shot. <laughs> kind of surprised Como's hanging out there. So far, the Union still holds this hill. CSA has not been able to push them off. In fact, A and B had to pull back from that position. Pull back into the woods a bit. 
Где суд? Целься в уровень поля. Окей. Так сейчас посмотрим. Огонь! Заряжай! Oh, now we have an attempted flank maneuver here by Hookah. Trying to get around CSA. You see uh, GC has been pushed off by that arty fire. See where Hookah's thinking of going. Going to cut in right or is he going to try to capture that stronghold right there? He is on point. He has to be cognizant of this. This is the problem going through the point when you can't sprint. It's a little dangerous. Took a little bit too long to do that maneuver with that. Uh, I don't blame him for doing it. I'd like it. The problem is with the uh, double quick, you just don't have enough time to make it. Saw them get caught out, and the 8th Florida saw it coming well, and has made it. them pay for it. On a perdu du monde, Perdrien. Tough gunfight for this hill, again, without sprinting and without bayonets. It's really not a desire to uh, press the fight. The Union, though, is starting to fall behind on tickets quite a bit here. They are the attacker, though. We have no new We do the following. We run one more back. When we hit the salve, we shoot and we run and we run back. See, LFL has been... Uh, I didn't see it, but you can see LFL has been defeated off here. Um, now you do have the NYV who has likewise done a bit of a uh, maneuver it's backfield here, which I rather like. Just to keep this already crew busy and farm some tickets. I can't believe that. Are they aiming at... This is a big mistake. This is a waste of time. You don't use Artie against skirmishers, it's just silly. I will run and ask infantry to come help us. That's what you should be doing. You know, wasting your Artie shot on them is, is, is pointless. Killed nobody. Let's see what's going on over here. Looks like GC's moving up. Oh God, doesn't. Auf die roten Hosen schießen. 
Okay, those are dead zombies like that. That's who they're shooting at, okay. Wieso wird hier mein mein Pfosten belagert? Wenn du down the road, watch out. Uh, we also need help with the artillery, please, if you're able. Danke fürs Platz machen, Alex. It's not it's time to get out of here, Bieber. We're now outflanked, my good friend. <laughs> Not as devastating as it could have been. I'm surprised with 3rd Alabama, usually it's epic shots in that. You can see A and V has rotated back over here, and they are joined by the SB. It's going to make holding that hill very difficult for the Union, this angle that they have right now. So it looks like my clock is about 30 seconds off. So, uh, Charn, you now sprint and you now put on bayonets. So LFL's gonna try to take advantage of this here, but they got a lot of open ground to cover. They're gonna try to retake this uh, ASON position. We'll let them recover their flag, which is good. Into ranks, fall in. So right now we are at 30 minutes, just a, bit, a little bit under it, and it's about even. C Union's a little bit behind CSA on tickets. See if they can make up some of this ground now that they have uh, bayonets sprinting going. See, the CSA has now basically taken over this hill. HEL was the only unit left, and they've basically been wiped back here. Union is now at engaged. That's a schöne Entfernung for Buck and Ball, falls it's not aufgefallen ist. Got O'Keefe and his guys here on top of the hill occupying it. This may be a problem here for this Union. A and V is on the move now. Looks like he will be able to catch this remaining Union element here, which is AGL from behind. In a nice pinch along with 52nd. And that will end that hill occupation. Now they can have great shots onto the Union here as they try to come over here. And also keep the Artie busy and keep them off. 
So that's a pretty decisive position for the CSA to hold on to. Who's over here? Somebody was engaging over there. I'm not sure quite what that was. Uh, Fort Georgia? I guess he's joined with him. Oh, he's just uh, serrating him with some music. Fire! Wasn't that Six Texas is in a bit of trouble here. They are outflanked now. It's the problem with letting the CSA take this hill position. But the Union has responded, and they are going to try to drag the fight back into the center here by capping the point. We'll see if this works out for them. I don't think it's a bad idea. In fact, I think it's probably the best idea they could do right now. Now, if I was a CSA, would I be on a rush to recap? Um, there is, it's 19 minutes. They may be able to shoot him out to a final push here. Or last stand, I should say. Um, I would go for that option right now. You have all the positioning. If they want to funnel troops into here, just massacre them. And uh, you might be able to do it. We'll see. Fire will to the right. Fire will to the right. Fucking bolted. You can see how good of a job the CSA is putting, you know, intersecting fields of fire here against this Union element and just massacring them from multiple angles. So it looks like the, Un the CSA is going to uh, go for the quick recap. I think that's a mistake, but um, it is the safer option. There's a guy from SB again. See, they quickly knocked him off of points, but uh, I think he could have farmed some more tickets off of that. You see, the CSA won't get any uh, additional respawns, you know, additional tickets off of it. Ooh, AGL's charging in. That's a mistake. I don't know why you're doing that. She's lined up to get destroyed. I have no idea why he's standing here. Williams is dancing over here. They've shot everybody but him. Oh, there we go. Shot him in the ass. Again, I would not have kept I would have just kept going. Look, we're only at 16.30 here, and they're almost at taking losses. Now, you can't engage them from uh, Maine, but, uh, yeah, well. So we'll be at 26 minutes with CSA at engaged. And uh, Union also engaged, but about a third left. I'm kill pressing forward here. He's gonna catch Al Bell on the flank too. Devastating charge here from the A and B, and not even from behind, from the side. 
uh, Killer is expanding his repertoire. So I know they know. A and V knows, but now they know they hit him in the side, not just from the back. So an additional vector of vulnerability has been introduced by Killer in the A and V. And CSA still controls the hill. Yeah. And you do have Dar out here, but he's he's really not much of a factor at the moment. Trying he's trying to keep the Artie a little bit busy, but it's not really changing the battlefield very much. Oh, this is a mistake. Don't send out onesies and twosies to get flags. They just get sniped. You might succeed, but nine times out of ten, you'll just get sniped out of line. See, they make it out. Oh, well, they're actually making it out. Oh, that was the ninth time. That was the tenth time, I suppose. Oh. Cancel uh, uh, shot, but didn't look like it had the impacts they were hoping for. And we aimed it a little bit low. It's always a habit with canister. Oh, another charge here. This time by 52nd. I think they got a little bit too overexposed, though. And they're getting nailed by the cell of Force as they chase this cannon. That, I think, was a mistake. There was no need for that little charge. Yes. And not a good charge there. CSA is firing into main. Are they? It's it's tough to tell a little bit. Uh, maybe they might be firing at these guys coming in. I'm not sure. Yeah. Could be. Third Alabama is going to try a flanking maneuver here to catch the A and B, and I think they will succeed. They've learned. Third Alabama also knows to hit him from the side. And they will succeed. That's two CSA regiments who have now been wiped out. They're getting a little bit, uh, CSAs get a little bit too, uh, Too aggressive here, too too ballsy, yep. and they are getting caught out too a little bit too often here. And now the Union has retaken this hill. We'll see how that changes the battlefield up. They're ahead, but there's plenty of time left in the ball game. Union has now hit taking losses. SB nice going in a nice little angle here. Get ready to die, boys. It's a nice piece you're having. But the LFL was waiting for him. Nice little reverse slope here by the LFL. Let's 
see. In the meantime, we've got the Union getting a little bit aggressive over here. The Pyrians coming! Fall back or me for Fall back or me Fall back! On the start. It's like NYV had to pull back a bit, but if they're drawing some infantry over, that's not a bad thing. They've drawn GC to deal with them, so right. even just uh, keeping an element busy may not be a bad thing. And you see, Six Texas is pushing back the SB all the way back to this fence over here. It's as far as you can go, though, unfortunately. Up out of bounds. I, I think the inbounds route. Out to the inbounds uh, limitations on this map for the Union are very annoying. Form line to my right, form line to my right. Form line to killer's right. Put the ball down that road, gentlemen. All the ranks, come on, press it. Fix it again. Get your own bodies. Enforcements. So do we. Right, the left leg. Fuck. Again? See, the CSA still is being super aggressive and it's starting to piss away their ticket lead here a bit. I think they're making a big mistake. Here's another one by 52nd. Once more, overextending, I think, in my opinion. The go keep is making a mistake here. They've been caught out again. So the Union has completely recaptured this side of the field here. And has continued to uh, gain back some of the tickets here. We're at 19 minutes. And we are very close now to taking losses for the CSA. That is, they pissed away a lot of this advantage, to be honest with you. We'll see if the Union can turn it around here. Formando. Y el resto de la compañía. Muerta. Muertos. Joder. Si mientras subimos. No sé quién andaba. Si ves su vida. Y shower. Gleiches Ziel commence firing, wenn ihr Sicht habt. Ziel van la Sicht. Ziel van la Sicht. Ziel van la So again, you know, I, I, would, I, I said earlier that NYV was not really having great effects. I, I'm going to amend my statement and say I was wrong here. If they are drawing not only the GC, but uh, the majority or all the arty fire with their few men, they are doing a fantastic job here. That is a great use of the skirmishers and exactly what they should be doing. So I'm going to amend my statement regarding that. Nah. They are having a very big effect on this battlefield. Ooh, third Alabama now getting caught a little bit out. So now the CSA is being a little bit more conservative here. And they are doing a lot of damage now. That cannon is just left the door, these gentlemen. Just left the door. You are independent of anything that crests the hill. Cut the aim, cut the grass. You see the flags? Cut the grass, cut the grass. Where we looking? Up and over. Alright, so now let's see who is this? Six Texas has moved out. Are they going to cap? This is... I, I, I don't think I'd cap right now. A nice shot. Catching uh, East Florida here as they're moving off. But again, I'd be very cognizant of capping right now. I think they're a little bit too low on tickets. You'd be in danger of getting put on final push here. Especially at engage. Maybe if you haven't taken losses. I could see it. Not on engaged. No, no, no. Yeah, again, that, I think this is a mistake by Six Texas here. 
transformando. Uh, 12 minutes now. I, now, now I would absolutely not recap right away. You have 12 minutes to try to get him onto a final push, which is about a morale state and a half. And I think you can do it easily as a CSA. We'll see if that's what they go for. Get out of here. Get that flag out of there. Get the flag out of there. Get that flag out. Get that flag out. Get that flag out. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Keep going. Shoot a rock. 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 Regroup! Regroup! Independent fire shoots at the Confederates on the fence line. By the way, this game is called War Rights. It's available on Steam for 30 US dollars. Uh, this event is an organized private event. It is the United European Community event, hosted every Friday and Saturday at 8 p.m. GMT. Link in the description uh, if you want to sign your unit up. And if you're a new player looking for an event and you see I, you see a unit that you're like, man, these guys sound cool. Uh, feel free to check them out. I have links for all these units in the description as well. So head up to their Discord and sign up. And you too can be a member of any of these units if you so desire. And of course, if you're liking a video and want to help me out, I always appreciate any likes, subscribes, uh, comments you guys have on the, uh, the events, the video. Back they go. Looks like the CSA is going for the recap. They're now taking losses again. I think this is a, a mistake. I would I would try to press my luck a little bit more. It's it's risky. It is absolutely risky to do so. But I I think um, I think you could pull it off. But uh, otherwise, you go back in here, and you know you're at 1530. You're at taking losses. Gentlemen, come on, fall in. Hello, guys. Are you a. Uh, yeah. I'm, I'm searching. It floated the. Uh, I want to speak to her. Vincent, want to ask right. something uh, about. They just got wide uh, right. <laughs> That was interesting. <laughs> I think he forgot he was on the CSA. Usually, third Alabama's on the CSA, so he might have just forgotten what team he was on. Always hit T, though. If you don't see a name, you're on the wrong team. All right, so um, they did go for the recap here at 1520. You know, I would I disagreed with it, but um, that's what they went for. That is that is the safer option. Uh, they got to be careful, though, not to piss away their tickets now. For the Union, I would try to slow up the fight here a bit. Uh, conversely, for the CSA, I'd, I'd try to... Uh, I'd also slow up the fight here. Now, which one does it actually benefit more? Um, ugh, ugh. No, Union's got to make some difference here. They got They got to... They gotta make up, so I'd be a little bit more aggressive as a union. Just gotta be careful not to lose too many, so you gotta be aggressive without losing too many, which is a bit tough. But, um, I think that's the only way you're gonna win. CSA, I just drag out the time a little bit, let the union kind of wash over you. I challenge you to a Gentlemen, now! This isn't a bad play at all by the NYV in the uh, Fort Georgia. Doing some damage to the 8th Florida, but oh, wait a second, here comes Killer. And that will end that.
<laughs> got six Texas trying to catch a flank on 56. They got behind them. This might work out pretty well in their favor. Again, the unit needs to be aggressive right now, so I absolutely support this maneuver here. And indeed, 56 Texas has easily defeated the 56. So a nice little victory there. Open now, 50 seconds getting chased down. So this is working out very well right now for the Union. This is what you want to do. Catch a lot of these guys out of line, skirmishing. All right, so now kind of zooming out here, you see the Union still holds that hill in this left side of the field here, but they are uh, close to breaking, but they've done a little bit of damage with those couple of attacks of the CSA. I keep it up trying to get them down to breaking. You know, you might be down breaking as well, but you might be able to get them down and sneak on the point. I think be the, be the strategy I'd go for right now. Bit of a skirmishing fight over here. Aim at them, boys. Bring the lid first, nice west. Company, take aim, right side of the tree. Fast one. Reload. Reload, chest, reload. So the Union is flooding a lot of forces over on this left side. By the right flank. This might work out well. They can catch the skirmishers and maybe the Artie for some good tickets, so this might be a uh, that would be a good move here, I think, by the AGL. Prepare for charge. Prepare for charge. Again, right now, you're ticket hunting right now is what you need to be doing. Come, Alle auf eine Höhe. Ich sehe kein Bayonet neben mir. Kommt. Last shot. Last shot. Die laufen schon. Dich daran, nicht schießen, nicht schießen. Es hat doch keiner was von ihm gesagt. Dich daran, dich daran, dich daran, dich daran. Artillerie hat geschossen. Holt euch die Artillerie. Cha cha cha. And you can see the Union is now hit breaking. Oh, why are they capping right now? I, I have no idea why they're capping right now. That makes no sense to me. Yes, sir. That seems to be the option. I guess they're going to make it a fight now on points. Uh, here comes A and B with a nice flank. A&V is going to watch over the side of these guys here. It's a major tick. It's seven minutes now to get the Union onto uh, last stand here. Again, I wouldn't go in right for the recap. Just shoot them. I, I don't understand what they're doing. This actually works very much to the benefit of the Union now. As they can uh, even out the ticket score quite a bit here. Start with the arty, retake the arty, and just roll it up. CSA perspective. Union, if you want to hold this, you can, but it's I've seen units get just crushed doing so. Now they do have some forward elements out here, which buys them some more time. So that's a good that's a good plus on them. Uh, SB going into the jaws here. This is that is not going to end well for them. It's committing suicide. Now five. Williamson knocking them out. Shoot him down. 
You got five minutes to do uh, half a morale state if it looks close on your recap. But... Brace left, gentlemen. Brace the left. 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 Brace the Here comes the attack coming after that already. Very well timed there by Rousseau. He might be able to sneak up and hit 56 here from the side in a nice off angle charge. And another great charge by the Six Texas. Now we see the CSA, though, I would say, again, this is the right angle of attack here, in my opinion. So now you got four minutes to get them down to last stand. I think if you, if you, if you recap before then, the problem is who you're going to be. Well, you'll have them on final push, so it's not a horrible thing. Now we're at three minutes here. They are very close to last stand. Again, a little bit more shooting, I think, would have gotten them there. I would actually pull off as a union right now and let them recap. And then you have 10 minutes, you know. Well, eh, that's a tough decision, to be honest with you. The reason it's tough is, yeah, you got 10 minutes, but you're very close to final push. So you really don't have 10 minutes. Um, staying defend. I think pulling off as far as they did is, is the right decision. You can still kind of contest it a bit, but uh, you're not overcommitting. See so again, the CSA at two minutes. You got plenty. Of, oh man, you're gonna you're not gonna put him into final push or last stand before you recap. I see you say so close to doing it. Gonna miss by maybe 10 15 seconds here. See how many seconds before they go to final push here. And it's a huge difference between final push and last stand, by the way. You know, last stand, they don't get any more respawns, and as soon as you do it, they win. Versus final push, where they get unlimited. So, you know, if you can manage it, it's really good. And they were so close to it, they, I, a little bit more discipline, I think they would have had it.
And now, by the way, the CSA has got to hold on point. So I don't know why the Union's being so aggressive right now. And not, you know, shooting it out a little bit before uh, the final push hits. That's the final push. Check, sir. Yeah. CSA's got a hold for two minutes now. Uh, minute 30, no you won't. Ooh, well-timed army shot. Party shot, I should say. I keep hitting T so I can check on the timer, by the way. Come on, bandits! Captain, charge! Charge! I agree with him. I'm gonna push him off to get on a limited response. The well, Union is winning point right now. We'll see if the CSA can fix it. They haven't put him onto last stand yet, though, which is probably the biggest problem. Oh, there you go. They're on point now. I think you missed your window. That is the end. CSA has won. Tough fight at the end there. I think a few few mistakes by both teams kind of made it a little bit closer than it needed to be. But um, interesting match. A lot of tough fighting. I think the uh, HRE rules uh, work well, though, uh, for this map. I, don't, I think um, made it very close, very tough fight. So... Good to see. You. That's it for the UEC for today. We got one more tomorrow. Should be able to catch it. I don't know. But uh, for the rest of you, I hope you enjoy your Friday, and I will see y'all next time.